Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you may be. It's like a warlord, the stash. Hello, everyone. Hope you're doing well, recovered from your holiday festivities. Don't worry, we have a couple more days left in the year and a couple more days for our favorite crypto, non-decentralized, not Web3 gaming, L1 chain providing maybe no evidence because there's no actual database for you to verify company you may know of as gala games slash music slash film aka blockchain game partners whose founders are in a mo uh, over half a billion dollar lawsuit with each other to let us down one more time before the end of the year that's right ladies and gentlemen one of the games that some of you are looking forward to because you have no taste in sports and you think that soccer is a real sport we're looking forward to a game called project ld that's right <clears throat> Another one bites the dust. Another one. Another one. Another one. Another one. So as always, we go to our favorite place for information. Twitter, a.k.a. X. Let's see what old man Smithers has to say. Old man Smithers. Always here for a good bit of commentary. You should go follow him on Twitter. He's a good guy. It's a good guy. I like him. Not just because he always says things that I like, but I think he's a good person. At least from what I can tell. And he follows me on Twitter. He didn't block me on Twitter like Bitbender did or Gala Games did. Did you know that? Did you know that Gala Games' is Twitter, official Twitter blocked me? As well as Bitbender? Did you know that? Benefactor still hasn't blocked me. I guess he must enjoy what I tweet. Keep that in mind, will you? But let's see what we have here. Old Man Smithers says, Freestyle Football 2 was announced with great fanfare and Malta for Galaverse 2. Relevant part is here. Well, let's check it out. Okay, we're going to mute this because it's going to get claimed if I don't. Uh, Joy City appears to be the company that is talking about what? Ah, okay. Here we go. Here's our relevant information. Let's see what he has to say quickly. From our flagship IP to the Gala Games platform once more. Freestyle is our... Freestyle football. So soccer, right? Not football. That's American. And don't you even try to say it. American football is the real football. No one cares about soccer. Get out of here. But regardless, here we are talking about World premiere, a uh, new installment of the Freestyle series. I believe some of us saw this trailer. Let's look at it. We have a, uh, we can make it, is it 1080p? No, it's 720, okay. I remember seeing something, about, I think I remember seeing this trailer. Um, yeah, let's see if we got any audio. Guy walking out with some really aggressive spikes on his cleats, by the way. I don't know if that's the, this was like three quarter inch. Anyway, uh, some people playing uh, playing softball. There you go. Okay. Again, it's soccer to me. But anyway, so there you go. Uh, do we have a... Shut up, phone. Do we have a release date or anything on here? Gala Games. Okay, there you go. All right. Hey, hey, there's Robotron. You remember him? He doesn't work for Gala Games either. It's almost like, it's almost like there's, like, like something that connects all of these issues we've been seeing in the past year or two. It's crazy. It's like there's, it's like they all kind of point to one direction. I, 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 is, is it over here? Is it that? I, I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> R.I.P. Robotron. So anyway, there you go. Notice that Fortitude is being advertised right before that clip on FSF2. I did notice that. Uh, let's see. Where are we advertising Fortify? There's Grit. Yeah, you guys remember Grit, right? Walking Dead Empires. Grit. And there's Robotron again. RIP Robotron. Okay, I don't see... Uh... Oh, there's Fortitude. Okay. So yeah, that's uh that got that that was a rug pull too. 
but yeah, so uh, note the photo tube was added to right before. Anyway, today was announced that the deal with Joy City and Go Gala Games has been terminated. Can I see this? Is it, am I still blocked? Oh, 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 come on, guys. You blocked me. Oh, shucks. Gosh. Mm. Mm. So this is a reporter, uh, Kim Ung Tai, saying that Joy City announced on the 28th that the publishing contract for the new game Project LD worth $25.9 billion. One signed with Block Game, game Partners, also known as BGP, also known as Gallic Games, has been terminated. The cancellation amount is 25.86 of recent sales. The company explained the contract for this termination was other parties to publish games developed by our company, but it was difficult to expect fulfillment of the contract due to other parties' withdrawal from the PC game business. So it was terminated by agreement with both parties. Now, let's see if we can find this, uh, this title. All right, after much digging, I found uh, this uh, Korean website, which... I had to search for blockchain game partners to find it, but here we are. Uh, this is the uh, link. I will attach that to the video down below. Let's go. I have it translated to English right now. We're going to leave it in Korean, and then we're going to see if we can Google Translate. Uh, are you going to let me copy? Google Translate. Detect. Oh, oh, well, that didn't do me any good. Let's see if we can Google Translate it like this. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what Google Translate has for us. Okay. Uh, Joy City announced on the 28th that the publishing contract for the game project is worth 25.9 billion won. So uh, let's let's see what that is in uh, in in uh, all American dollars. USD. 20 million US dollars. Why? Wow. That's a lot of money. That's, that's a lot. Isn't, that, isn't that a lot of money? Yeah, it is a lot of money, Freedom Funnel. All right. So, Joy City terminates. Contract's uh, termination was for the other party to publish games developed by our company, but it was difficult to expect fulfillment of the contract due to the other party's withdrawal from the PC game business. So it was terminated by agreement between both parties. Okay. So original text. Let's see if we can go into Google Translate. Okay. And uh, we'll let it detect the language. Let's copy the original text and put it directly into here. Okay. Yeah. Due to the other parties that withdraw from the PC game business. Notice that the word PC, right? And then that looks like game to me. PC game, right? Right? Would you agree? If we look at the original Korean, you can see PC right here. So PC game business, that seems like it's what it's saying. All right. Let's get back to Old Man Smithers. All right. There are a lot of different translations to English, but all of them share one thing in common. The article reports that the deal was terminated because the publisher Blockchain Game Partners is no longer in the PC gaming business. News to some, but not to those who have been paying attention. I'm sure Gala's spin on it will be that the studio demanded outrageous sums of money, etc., much like they're doing with Gamedia and Spider Tanks. Also like they're doing with Drifter, who's actually actively suing them. As far as Gamedia is concerned, I can say an official statement from what I've been told is that there is no ongoing lawsuit between them all. That they've just ceased communications with Gala, and the, a lot of people have noticed they've removed themselves from the Discord. Now, as someone who hasn't been in the Gala Games Discord for a while, I'm shocked, but here we are. Uh, we have a message from Bitbender uh, twice that says, We haven't purchased their whole company outright for an undisclosed price tag. Okay, so we'll see if that's true because he said that Bitbender, uh, that Bucks was apply, uh, still employed by the company, but she clearly wasn't. Uh, and they are willing to hold the community and us hostage until they get what they want. Now, again, like I said, there seems to be some common threads here. Maybe you two can, maybe you can put them together, right? What, what do you, what do you think, Freedom Funnel? Yeah, yeah, I think it's Gala too. <laughs> 
I've been told the above is categorically false, but who knows? Good media is staying silent. Yes, they are. Again, I got an official, uh, unofficial off the record message. It's not really off the record, but it was. I, I offered good media, and if good media, if you happen to watch this, again, the offer still stands. If you would like a platform to say things to the community, I would be more than happy to have you on, and it'd be unedited. We can just talk, whatever you would like, uh, because the community would, I'm sure, like to know what's going on, and uh, yeah. Offer still stands. Um, new work on Spire Tanks appears to have been effectively halted. We may end up reading about this yet in another lawsuit and things to come. Again, I was told there is no current lawsuit. That doesn't mean there's not going to be, but that means there's not one current. I'd say it's troubling when a gaming company keeps losing games and millions of dollars worth of time and effort getting them, but as Article and Gala themselves have noted, they're not a gaming company anymore. That was something that I was supposed to bring up. It was an uh, interview that uh, Bitbender did where they're not a gaming company. Let's 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 see if I can find that. Give me a second. All right, uh, here we are. It is. Uh, it was an interview with Faz. Uh, the chapter is called "What Is Gala Games?" Just, I want to get some basic definitions here. What what exactly is Gala Games? What do you do? I mean, are you a game developer? Are you a publisher? Are you both? How come people want to know what the what the fuck you guys are? People. Uh, so this isn't this isn't. Let me translate for you. Let me let me translate let me translate for you with that exasperated sigh, the rolling back of the head. <sighs> Listen here, you dumb fucks. Okay, shut the fuck up. I gotta I gotta put I gotta put fucking jet fuel in Benny's jet. I don't have time to answer your stupid fucking question. I know we're called Gala Games, but that doesn't mean we're actually a game company. Okay, you stupid, ignorant motherfuckers. Like, shut the fuck up, okay? Just shut up. I'm tired of answering your stupid fucking... Just sit there and let me make money off of you. That, that, that's, that's what he just said. And there, there you go. I just translated for you. You're welcome. But, but we'll continue. Interesting and complex question because what we really are is way the hell bigger than people think. People have a tendency to look at us and say, oh, guys, you guys make you, you do games. You're a game publisher. You're a game producer. You do music. You do film. The reality is, is that we're we're a lot more than that. I think that the way that we really should be looked at is as an L1 protocol that happened to start in entertainment, but was built with everything in mind. So there you go. Gala Games isn't the Gala Games doesn't make you just there. There's so much more than that. Is there anything? Le is, should we keep listening? Let's see. And so, I think that that's that's the big thing. Yes, we do publish some games. Yes, we do have teams that make games, um, but that isn't our main focus. Well, no shit, Sherlock. That certainly isn't your main focus. That's what you thank you for making it clear. That's not your main focus. I think it's obvious now, uh, even though you made billions of dollars selling FTs, fungible tokens. They're not actually non fungible tokens. They're actually FTs. You sold billions of dollars worth of FTs and nodes for games that aren't even there anymore for games that weren't games, the fuzzles, the orbs. 888 you sold all this stuff right but it, we're not about we're not about games right we're not about we're not about games okay guys we're not that's that's the old me this is the new me okay just give me more of your money um it is a huge focus it is it is it consumes a tremendous amount of our resources but the the long-term goal here is is really protocol level like how do we create something that enables the next generation of builders in gaming we're just gonna stop there because i don't that that's not what they're doing D don't d don't don't fu just stop okay just stop but you heard it here uh from the king of kool-aid himself faz interviewing uh bitbender uh jason brink you may know him as from the recent lawsuits They're not a gaming company. Shut the fuck up. Okay? So anyway, back to old man Smithers. Uh, Bitbender says, I sent an, an at Invest Answers, a DM clarifying a few points from his stream regarding Gala. Let's see what he says. Would love to clarify a couple things 
We never shill, ever. We have never told anyone to buy Gala. We don't maintain a giant dev bag to dump, and our tokenomics are extremely transparent. That's a lie. That's a lie. That's a lie. That's a lie. So those are all lies. Cool. Next. Uh, we aren't a gaming token. We are an L1 protocol with our own chain. Since when? Since you did that interview with Faz? Since when? Since when is Gala Games not a Gala gaming to What? We started in entertainment for a variety of reasons, but that isn't the main focus at all. Uh, I am Jason. <laughs> I am Jason. The president of blockchain at Gala. And I would like to invite you into ahead of the game. To talk, to talk about, about what, what we, we have, have going on. Ahead of the game. Wait, ahead of the ahead of the game. But you're not a gaming company. Why would it be called ahead of the game? I don't understand. Which one is it? Are you fucking gaming company or are you not? Make your mind up, bro. Jesus Christ. I know he's I know he's gotta be the politician, you know, but like you can't it's like he's saying shit out of both sides of his mouth. I am Jason, the president of blockchain at Gala. <laughs> That's just how I envision him saying it, right, as he's typing it. I am Jason. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know. I'm, 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 I know. I'm just, uh, okay. All right. Let's move on. All right. Our sympathies to those folks who bought into the initial hype and purchased one of those gaming company NFTs. I'm right there with you. All right. Thank you, Old Man Smithers. I'm going to link this to you guys. I'm also going to link the original Korean website article for you also to see. And since we brought it up, I will also link to you um, this video with a timestamp so you can see uh, the part that I share. Okay. All right. Let's make this full screen because that'll make a great background. What do we think? Well, again, I just think that we've got... Jason, the head of blockchain at Gala. Right? I've got him here running his, flapping his gums. Okay? You got Faz, who's just suckling at the Gala teat, just drinking all the delicious Kool Aid. You got that going on. That, that, that being said, that, this interview is going to prove to you why I'm always right. Okay, I'm always right. I told you they don't care about you. I told you they don't care about Town Star. They don't care about Spider Tanks. They don't care about Superior. They don't care about the Fuzzles. They don't care about Fortitude. They don't care about Legends Reborn. They don't care about the Orbs. They don't care about 888. They don't care about you. And the sooner you understand that and the sooner you realize that, the better you'll be in this space. Am I telling you to leave this space? No. I love the community. I actually care about the community. I love the community. I'm glad that y'all are here. And I hope you're doing well. And I hope you can finally see through all the BS. There's a reason why there is a lawsuit between the co-founder and the other co-founder. Things are not okay. Whatever they try to tell you, they look over here while we're taking money and filling up the jet over here. Whatever the case may be, you have to see through it, guys. You can't just keep drinking the Kool-Aid. And if you want to keep drinking the Kool-Aid, by all means, keep drinking the Kool-Aid. I can't stop you. I can only say, hey, man, stop drinking the Kool-Aid. But you're going to keep doing it. You're an adult. Do what you're going to do. I, I, I can't stop you, okay? But I care about you, and I want you to do the right thing. And I honestly don't think the right thing is to keep giving these people money. I don't think they've earned it at this point. I feel like they've, they've probably earned you to stop doing that. But, again, I can't stop you. So what do I think about uh, the football game, uh, soccer? I, I, it sucks. I, it just sucks. I was never going to play it. But it does suck that that would have been a, a way more mainstream thing maybe to get people in, right? Because soccer is extremely popular around the world. I'm not, I'm not an idiot. I know it's not a real game, but people seem to like it for some reason. So, yeah, that would have been great. And this developer seems to have had a, you know, they were willing to bring their franchise into the Gala Games platform. And uh, obviously we have some lost in translation there. But it seems clear enough to me that there's the common thread of a problem called blockchain game partners slash gala slash gala game slash gala music slash gala film okay but that, that what do i know right what do you think huh what do you think freedom funnel 
Yeah, that's what I, I, I agree. I agree. You got any questions, please leave them down below. The easiest way to get a hold of me is Discord. I've got links to my Discord and my Discord name down below. If you would like to help donate and to help support the channel, I would appreciate it. Regardless, I'm glad you're here. I hope you had a wonderful holidays with your family. We've got New Year's coming up. Freedom Funnel, he'll be there. So, look at Faz. Look at Faz. Faz is looking right at him. Look at it, Faz. Don't, don't let Faz intimidate you. Don't let him intimidate you, bro. He's, he got this. I love you all. Hope you have a great rest of your week. I will see you soon. Soon. I'm liking Warlord. Dustash. Take care, everyone. I love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>you so much for watching this video i want to shout out my patreons patrons from patreon and my new youtube members as well i got that going appreciate all of you thank you so very much your help has been crucial to keeping me alive and keep streaming and keep helping and hopefully entertaining you along the way anything i can do to make it more worth your while please let me know down below also you can find me on my discord i have my discord server link down below patreon links down below and then membership should be somewhere around here. Thank you all so very, very much. I really appreciate you. And I look forward to the future. And I hope you will come along for this journey with me. Thank you. Take care.